So what I had to do, what I have to do, I changed the battery on this camera. It's been in the truck for a couple of years, which means every time I start the truck, it charges. And the battery probably all not that good. So anyhow, as I was saying, I'm gonna have to find that. Uh, yeah, right, it's gonna be fun. Well, if worst comes to worst, I can make one. I'm gonna have to do that before I go any further. Are you recording? Yeah, and these are the right size washers too. So, these are probably the ones to start with. I was going to put bigger washers on them, on the back side, but there is enough room because of where the holes are. Now, is that going to tighten up enough? Yeah, it should. We'll see. Oh yeah? What's the matter, Nick? I know. Alright, wait a minute. I didn't open the gate. Uh, the first gate in the driveway. Because I didn't want him to go out there and try to lay in his dog bed when it was uh, pouring rain. Hey Nick, what you up to, buddy? Huh? That's my Nicky. I'm gonna have to take off the. Uh, why is this? Oh, one hole. Okay, cool. Oh, it has two sets of holes. I didn't see that. Oh, only on the bottom. Okay. I don't care. I'm not gonna go nuts when I use the two that I have. to have to take care of those radials. You know, Hustler used to be a good company. And uh, I've installed a few of these years ago. And they were never as cheap as I was. Alright, now, uh, if I'm really lucky, I'll find. If not, I don't know. I'll talk. What am I going to do here? Well, I think I'm going to do is I'm going to put this pipe in. And we're going to get it up out of the way until I do something with those radials. So, let's go ahead and get a, uh, what looks like a half inch. Uh, let's go this way. Because, um, I don't want Dar or the boys running around trying to dodge it with us. Mm. There's some more chicken wire. I can even use that if I had to. 
but I'd rather find the radio. I wonder if it's by chance on the roof. Alright, let's go in and get a ratchet. Let's go in and get what I need. Get the 3 h drive. Walk around the shed. Even you know if I just lean it up against the shed over there, at least it's upright. I uh, offered it to a friend of mine who's an amateur radio operator. And uh, I had put it all together for him. But then once you've seen it, See here, you can see right down, and there's no obstructions. Here, once you start getting down so far, this nut right here, which is on both sides, start working on where the socket starts to thicken. And that's what's stopping it from going all the way down. Again. here. I know it's not in there. These are those big job boxes that they put on the job site and they put all the tools and things in them. Uh, Chris across the street called me up one day and said, yeah, two of them. This one and one about half the height. It's over on the other side over there. Uh, so if I want them, 20 bucks. I can always use storage. All right, so let's put this ratchet and socket back. Darlene went through all the ratchets or sockets for me and separated them, which worked out quite well actually. Because I don't like them on the tray, the, the, the strips. So, uh, but as soon as I open it, now I can go here. These are standard quarters. These are uh, metric, uh, what you call it, uh, yeah, three eighths. Uh, this, these are standard three eighths, and these are metric uh, quarters. Okay, now, if, let's go see what it is. Let's do that first. Uh, all right, let's go. And I hate these antennas because of that. They remind me of, oh, I bet you. You know what? I gotta look. 
I'm, oh, I was going to say it reminds me of MFJ. Well, I'm wondering now if MFJ didn't buy into them. I'm going to go to the MFJ website. Because MFJ, no matter what you buy, you have to, you have to finish it. You have to modify it. You got to work on it. Okay, so what is that? Looks like a standard. Oh, there's two of them missing. I found a little. Did I just knock one off? No. Okay, I guess there. Is this the loose one? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I gotta take all those off. Alright, so it's a flathead. Alright, let's walk back. Can I go that way? Not really. And there's two of them missing, son of a bitch. I'm gonna look that up. I really am. I got a sneaky suspicion that uh, MFJ has something to do with it. I'm going to get the screwdriver and a pair of pliers. And then I'm going to bring the ladder back here because I want to look. As much as I don't feel like carrying the damn thing. Well, I might be able to do it with a six foot. Let me see. I don't even know where I put that one. Okay. So let me get a decent flathead. A little too small, but you know what? That may be okay. What's this one? That's a Phillips. Let's take this one. And these. And where's that ladder? You guys see a six foot step ladder around here? I don't. I think that'll work if I can remember where it is. I don't feel like carrying the big one. I should take it down though and move it. Uh, yeah, let me do it. I want to leave it all there. Let me shut you guys off for a minute. Okay, this is the wrong time of year to be looking for those because they're leaves. It's not on the roof, which means they could have fallen off this spring or this summer or this fall this year and uh, gotten blown off and could be under any of these leaves around here. Yeah, any of them. So, uh, I'm not going to go nuts. However, I want to see just how well you are recording. So I'm going to put you right here to see how it is. What I'm going to do is I'm going to set it up right and 
uh, I try to. I may have to wait until the wife comes home. Because then I need somebody to flip the pole. What I mean by flip the pole is put their foot on the bottom.